Island Pass Holder Preview Day. Got a little snag here on the way. So we're in traffic hell here on I-75 in Dayton. So, hopefully we make it there. We made it further than I thought we did before we got stopped. And we are going to ditch the interstate here at the next exit. If we can get to the next exit. Got about three quarters of a mile to go. Hopefully we can do it in under an hour, huh? Gotta be so We're going to uh, get off on 741 and just take the back way in because this this interstate is is a mess. Anything are, past 70 and Dayton sucks. Yeah, in between. Until you get past the Dayton Hall. Yeah, it's it's basically traffic hell is what it is. And there's not a good thing because you have people trying to get on the interstate to the exit we're trying to get off on. And they're trying to merge. Oh, here comes, here a, comes cop. a cop. We have to somehow get out his way. Well, that could explain Follow it. Follow him. <laughs> yeah, put the four ways on and let's go. back to Kings Island. It's pass holder preview night. It was a bear of a struggle to get down here through the traffic. It took us about two hours. They're only open till nine tonight, so that gives us about two hours. Check it out. That's probably enough time. It's a nice night. Yeah. It's probably about 60. Blue skies and sun. A little chill in the air, but not too bad. Okay, we made it in. Yep, no problems. Pass holder preview night. We got about two hours. We didn't eat, so we're gonna have to pick up a piece of pizza or something until we leave. We're gonna have to eat something here, but it's a nice night. It's pretty crowded. We don't anticipate riding much, if anything, today, but uh, we just want to get in and check it out. We've never been to a pass holder preview day before, so something new for us. Kind of strange, you're only open four to nine on a Friday night, so I'm not gonna be a whole lot of people taking advantage of it, but um, it is what it is. So we'll take advantage of the nice night. We'll try and take you around and show you what we can on opening night. before. Tom and Chi and chips. Okay, so we got a grilled cheese and a bag of chips. What will we pay for that? 13 something. Well, we'll see how it goes. Now you notice we, we split our meals. We're, neither one of us is big eaters. We're
We're not cheap. We're just not big eaters. It's not that long of a day, so to split a meal, it's a lot easier. Yeah, we'll probably stop. Probably stop at Skyline on the way out of here. Normally, we stop at Culver's or Cane's on the way in, but with the had to take a detour to get in here because of the traffic, so we didn't really pass any restaurants that we wanted to stop at. When you come on a Friday, you get screwed by Dayton traffic <laughs> between 70 and the Dayton Mall, so. We normally don't eat in the park, but. No, we don't normally eat the park. We usually just like have a beverage. It's a nice night. These are basically just grilled cheese with tomato. Tom and Chi has a, I think they're a chain I know there's one in Newport, Kentucky. I think there's more than that. Westchester. Westchester. And they put that in Kings Island last year. That used to be a um, Chick-fil-A. This comes with a balsamic dip, which is really good. And all this is gonna be open the late spring, so probably late May, early June, so I'll be open. One of the changes this year is this coaster's been painted. I think it's been renamed. It's called Woodstock's Air Rail. Kind of done the track in green and the supports in brown. And the big sign over there for Pigpen's Mess Hall. That's another new addition that's not open yet. picture on the fence of the new playground area. The new coaster behind it. Camp Snoopy's Beagle Scout Acres. There's a look over the fence at the new coaster with a bunch of copyright music blasting behind us. So gotta keep talking so we don't get a big strike. Flying scooter ride's been repainted, rethemed as Franklin's Flyer. So it's uh, all been rethemed to go with the new Camp Snoopy theme as, as the copyright music blares behind us. This year, right? Diamondback. We've yet to do it. It's not going to be tonight. It's down right now. Yeah. Before the season's over, though, right? Hopefully. We'll go try the seat out over there. Huh? So, so that's all to hold you in. Well, there's a seat belt too. Seat belt too. Yeah, and if you do. Opening day. Blues. All these people in line for the diamond back, and now it's down. There's only about an hour and ten minutes left in the day. 
So they most likely aren't going to get the ride at this point. Time to ride a train. Yep. At least we get one ride in. Let's see. Hey, we got the thumbs up. Got the new area on there. like the old subway to become the Kings Island frozen cocktail bar 21 and colder as the copyright music blares behind us even on this side of the park it's everywhere <laughs> so it'll be nice to see something in here again it's been been a while it's been empty
gonna do it for pass holder preview night. We're up on the Eiffel Tower. We're hoping to give you a shot with the uh, scenery behind us, but it's very windy up here. Kind of cold. So... A little breezy. Yeah, we, we barely got to make uh, one lap around the park because we only had two hours. So, we'll come back tomorrow. We have a little more time and show you a little more. Uh, got to uh, see a little bit of the new Camp Snoopy. There's not a whole lot you can see right now. Um, we also saw where the the old subway is going to become a adult slushy bar, which puts a smile on Sonia's face. We have the craziest lighting right here. Yeah. Well, it's because the light keeps changing colors up here. Well, anyhow, that's that's going to do it for tonight. So if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. And go ahead and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you down the road. Is this the year for delirium, Sonia? I'm not riding it. <laughs> you can ride it. Okay. Well, I'd get on, but they're about to close. Well, maybe next time. Oh. <laughs> They are loaded this one in. There's plenty of space for you. <laughs>